so here we have our elephant bush that I bought a week and a half ago, maybe two weeks ago. And it is time to trim her up. And I'm gonna need to repot her and stabilize the trunk. So I'm gonna trim her first. We'll get some cuttings that we can replant. And I will show you a little bit of part of my planning process. Hang on a second and I'll go grab it. Here is my plant without any background and what I did was just in a, a procreate app I just took my apple pencil and kind of cleaned around um, all the background images so I could isolate the plant itself and what I did was just sort of to get an idea of what it might look like once I started trimming because once you trim a branch you can't put it back so I wanted to get a visual what it might look like. So I basically started to trim things down. I want to do a, what's called a semi-cascade. Um, so part of it is up and part of it drapes over and down over the pot. So I'm probably going to end up clipping one of these branches as well, but this gives me an idea of how much I'm going to be cutting in and around it. This was just to give me a rough idea since I'm very new to bonsai. And I think once I get started cutting away, I will, uh, I'll get close to this, but actually even more bare <laughs> than what we see in the picture. But that was just an exercise for me to uh, get an idea of what, what I'm working with. So let's begin. Now, it's already pretty unstable with what's going on here. So this is what's called the Nabari. Uh, let's see. And I'm going to find the front and the back so I can determine which, which point of view I'm gonna be working with. I think I want, let's see, that's a good, that's a good, good branch I could have as my first down cascading branch. And then if I had this as my back, this is my right left back. What you do with bonsai, so I learned just yesterday <laughs> with one of the Weikert videos, uh, Mike Lane actually is who I watched do a repotting. You actually do a, uh, what's well, kind of a rule of thirds, uh, a rule of three, where you have the bottom part of the trunk is the nabari, the second third is the um, kind of the area where you have your branches go left, back, right, left, back, right, until you get closer to the top where you have a little bit more of a 360, um, more branches and stuff at top at the top so you can have kind of a canopy. Uh, but we've got a ways to go before we can get to a canopy. So I think if we start with That's probably going to be, let's just move one of my bamboo skewers for now so I can determine, see what I'm working with. And this is where they clip a lot of the leaves off so they get a better idea of what they're working with, but I'm not ready to do that yet. <laughs> So let's say we go, we keep, keep this one, then we'll clip this one. All right, so let's do that for starters. 
All right, and we've got our first cutting. <laughs> okay. Now we can go. And now this has got. Maybe I'll put this bamboo skewer back in. I don't know how much it's going to help me keep it stable while I'm working with it, but we'll see. Okay, so I know with this branch, if I cut this off, this will give more energy to to the branch. So I have now my second cutting. left, back. Okay, so if we keep this one, then let's get rid of this little extra growth. So there's energy towards more of the growth of the branch. suggests that we no front branches until the top front of the tree. So let's see which maybe this is our left back left this one. Oh, let's see right here. Let's get rid of this one first. We can train that to be at an angle here. This one off, let's see. Okay, so you know, I think I'm just gonna get rid of that one. All right, so I've determined this is our front, this is our left. I should have decided that earlier, but okay, so left, back, left, let's get rid of this.
bonsai soil. I'm going to wire the pot and in a way that I will be able to stabilize um, this root. Okay. Okay. So I've got some cuttings now that I'll be able to have some fun with. Quite a few actually. So I'm going to until I get a chance to work with them, I'm going to put them in some water, which will not be for very long, but keep them moist until I'm ready to do something with them. Right now I'm working on the big guy. All right, so I'll pour some water in here. Keep this puppy moist. Okay. Cuttings for now. Now we're going to put some scissors away. Um, these were really, really cool um, Amazon purchase. And Fabuki was a correct. Really good quality. 